Hey guys, we are traveling to Thakadi and this is the first pit stop of our trip and this is Veerapandi. The plan was actually to have a shower here but uh, this place is actually flooded. You can see that uh, plenty of water is running through this river and so we cannot have a shower here. So change of plans, we are heading directly to Thakadi. anticipated but the weather was fantastic it was cold it was misty no crowd uh, drizzling a bit everything perfectly set for a wonderful vacation so after having lunch at Piriya Cafe Tekadi we just went to the Rose Park just by hearing the name Rose Park you may get the feel that it is just like a flower garden like Grand Park in Patekanal uh, and Botanical Garden in Oti. But it is not the same. It is an activity park. You may get 8 to 10 activities there. The kids are crazy, so were the others. Here is the Rose Park. The next stop was Elephant Camp, Thekadi. There are a lot of elephant centers in Thekadi. Many of them just have two to three elephants. The best elephant center in Thekadi is the Elephant Camp. Hey. Hey. So guys, we are going for an elephant ride. Uh, we thought it would be very, very ordinary, but the experience is magical, it's superb. <laughs> The elephant center also has a Kalari center and Kathakali center. Once you are done with the elephant ride there, you can uh, spend some time in any of those. We went to the Kathakali show which in fact is Kerala's traditional dance show. The best part of the show is that we were watching the show and the dancer randomly called my sister to dance with her and my sister had an amazing time on stage. That was the highlight of the show for us. safari and boating in Thekadi and uh, there are a lot of trekking activities and jeep safari activities in Thekadi. Check the link above to get the detailed review about the jungle hike we went in Thekadi and here is the jungle hike we went in Thekadi and it is called as nature walk.
so after the hike we went to the so called best activity in tekadi boating in periyar lake but it was actually insane we have to park our vehicle somewhere and the forest department will take you in their bus to the lake you have to take tickets and have to wait in a queue for some time once the boats are ready to go it feels really sleepy and boring yes you may see some bisons and deers on the banks of the reservoir but that's pretty much it the boating is around 1 and 1/2 hours and all of us slept nicely in the boat after the boating we have to wait again in a big queue to get into the forest department bus so it's up to you to go for boating in tekadi personally i won't recommend it instead you can go for jeep safari in tekadi there are lots of jeeps offering you various kinds of packages depending on your depending on the money and time uh, we can't go for a jeep safari since we don't have time so that's all we have in this trip so see you guys in the next one until then this is sudan signing off tada